Your AI is confidently wrong. It cited a research paper that was never published. It recommended a library that does not exist. It quoted a statistic it invented on the spot. This is the hallucination problem, and it is devastating for production systems. Large language models do not know what they know. They predict plausible next tokens, not truthful ones. Ask about events after their training cutoff? Fabrication. Ask about your company's internal policies? Creative fiction. Ask for sources? Watch it generate fake URLs with real-looking domain names. For chatbots, this is embarrassing. For medical, legal, or financial applications, it is a liability nightmare. You cannot ship a product that lies with perfect confidence. The instinct is to train a bigger model. More parameters, more data, more knowledge baked into the weights. But this path has diminishing returns. You cannot memorize the entire internet. You cannot retrain every time information changes. The breakthrough insight? Stop trying to remember everything. Retrieve it instead. Give your model access to external knowledge at query time. Instead of asking, what do you know about X? You ask, here are relevant documents about X. Now answer. This is Retrieval Augmented Generation, or simply RAG. The model becomes a reasoning engine over your data, not a memorization machine. The knowledge lives outside the model. But how do you find relevant documents? Keyword search fails. If the user asks, how do I fix authentication errors, and your docs say, resolving login issues, keyword matching misses it entirely. Same meaning, different words. Enter embeddings. You convert text into vectors, lists of numbers that capture semantic meaning. Similar concepts land close together in vector space. Authentication error and login issue become neighbors, even though they share no words. An embedding model reads a chunk of text and outputs coordinates in high-dimensional space, hundreds or thousands of dimensions. Each dimension captures some aspect of meaning. The cool part, sentences with similar meaning cluster together. This is how machines understand that dog is closer to puppy than to democracy. Now comes retrieval. You have millions of document chunks, each converted to a vector. The user asks a question, you embed that too. Now find the nearest neighbors. Cosine similarity measures the angle between vectors. Small angle, high similarity. Your query vector points in a direction. You find document vectors pointing the same way. But searching millions of vectors by brute force is slow. Vector databases use clever indexing. Approximate nearest neighbor algorithms like HNSW build graph structures for lightning fast search. You sacrifice a tiny bit of accuracy for massive speed gains. The result? Millisecond retrieval across billions of vectors. Your question finds its answers instantly. Here is the complete flow. User asks a question, you embed the query, Vector search retrieves the top matching chunks, maybe five, maybe 20. These chunks get injected into the prompt as context. The language model reads this context and generates an answer grounded in your actual documents. The prompt is simple. You tell the model, here is some context. Now answer the question using only this information. Chunking strategy matters. Too small, you lose context. Too large, you waste precious token space. Overlapping chunks help preserve meaning across boundaries. Most systems chunk by paragraphs or by fixed token counts. The model never hallucinates about your data because your data is right there in the prompt. Basic RAG works. Advanced RAG dominates. Start with re-ranking. After vector search retrieves candidates, a more powerful model scores them again. Vector search is fast but approximate. Re-ranking is slow but precise. Use both together. Next, hybrid search. Combine semantic similarity with old-school keyword matching. Sometimes users want an exact phrase, and embeddings alone will miss it. Merge both approaches for better recall. Then there is query transformation. Vague questions get rewritten into precise search queries before retrieval even begins. Finally, multi-hop retrieval. Complex questions need multiple searches chained together. RAG transformed what AI can do in production. Customer support bots that actually know your product documentation. Legal assistants that cite real case law. Medical systems that reference current treatment guidelines, not outdated training data. Your proprietary data becomes instantly searchable through natural conversation. Employees ask questions in plain English. Answers come back grounded in your actual knowledge base. No fine-tuning required. Update a document and the AI knows immediately. This is the architecture behind every serious enterprise AI deployment. Not a bigger model, not more training. Just smarter retrieval feeding a reasoning engine. RAG does not make AI smarter, it makes AI honest.